two of us can still coordinate our efforts. <laughs> Bentilia, a truly fearsome enemy. If she hadn't attempted to turn me into a pawn of destruction, I'm afraid victory would have been far from certain. <clears throat> Fantilia had established a link between me and herself. Her well-timed strike gravely injured her. Thus, her connection to the arbor was severed. It takes more than that to destroy an emanator of destruction. Still... Fantilia won't be stirring up trouble anytime soon. Don't worry about her infecting the arbor again. It's just that sealing the Stellaron is going to take some time. Leave that to the Master Diviner. Whew. I'm afraid I may be <laughs> somewhat spent. Uh, General, keep those eyes open. Now's not the time to fall asleep. Uh, uh, hey, wake up! Where there are people, there is noise. Unka mai cheva. questo là del da fatta specie so danger actually i first wanna allow c'è ne basti che tu dovresti Shot her. Fentilia the change that she saw here on the bridge be three to my bona camera or come. Try harder. I don't want to talk. She didn't want to take it. I don't want to look for a little bit of 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 a little in lunar flame. Blade of moonlight. Ephemeral. 
I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. How dare you! Try harder. You're wasting my time. Just a little something. Think nothing of it. Don't worry. It's just a scream. Perhaps you skin and you never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Free will, or was it destined for oblivion? I'm waiting. Jesus, they shall last one shot. Jesus, they shall last one shot. Și ăla mare somn, l-a zis, pai, eu nu eu vă las, ceau, nu, nu mai... There is a story in every scar. Dacă ești că astea sunt trebuie să sunt și în level 4. Something that I cannot make. Level 14. Ah, okay. Let's continue. Curious. Asta nu mai știu. Asta trebuie 250. Where there are people, there is noise. What is your purpose for entering the seat of divine foresight? Jinglio's old home, forbidden here, forbidden in sea and jewel. Wait a little moment. The Master Diviner will be here soon. She's temporarily taken on the General's responsibilities. Before meeting you, she must make the current situation known and fortify public spirit. This is her first real test as a General. I hope she can get used to things quickly. I don't think I can ever get used to this. Pleasure to see you all here today. Collating casualties and losses. Dispatching forces to round up the remnants of the disciples. Submitting battle reports to the six charioteers. Now I know what Jing Yuan meant when he said, The highest throne faces the strongest winds. Generalship is no trifling matter. How could I be enjoying myself? All I can do is get used to it. <laughs> I think she's enjoying herself. Master Diviner, have you summoned us here just to sigh and complain? Of course not. On the contrary. I am eager to thank you all in my official capacity as Acting General of the Law Fu. Now that things have drawn to a conclusion, it is time to reward you. Ooh, all those benefits that the General promised! They're finally here! Yippee! Yes. The Astral Express has braved great evil for the Law Fu. Your devotion is evident. After discussions with the Six Charioteers, you are henceforth sworn allies of the Law Fu. Within the Law Fu's jurisdiction, you are to be treated with the highest standard of diplomatic protocol. On behalf of the Astral Express, I would like to thank you, Master Diviner. Oh, wow. Nothing tangible then? Uh, but at least it sounds.
sounds pretty cool. Now that things have been expressed, I still have something to discuss with you. Please, this way. of Sanctus Medicus Rebellion, the Arbor's Resurrection, not to mention the Antimatter Legion infiltrating the Lafu. All of these incidents need reporting at the highest level for investigation. It's just that, having been in the middle of everything, I'm struggling to keep an accurate perspective. I would appreciate if you could go through it all with me, so that I can reacquaint myself with a finer detail. So, where should we begin? It appears that Fantilia was the mastermind behind it all. The Sienjou warred with the Antimatter Legion in the past, and ever since we have kept a watchful eye on their movements. Few could have foreseen the insidious tactics employed in the execution of their assaults. The Lord Ravager slithered in unnoticed, clandestinely plotting and machinating, and surreptitiously bestowed a Stellaron upon the disciples of Sanctus Medicus. This heinous act instigated an uprising aimed at luring the Lothu into a perilous trap of self-destruction. The present danger posed by the Legion clearly demands a re-evaluation. We should proceed cautiously. The Stellaron Hunters. We know just as little. But in the Matrix of Prescience, I saw a prophecy that Kafka received from Destiny's Slave. Elio foresaw all manner of possibilities for the Lawfu. Based on what Kafka knows, and despite everything being under the control of Elio, that prophecy is indeed the most beneficial future for the Lawfu. The Stellaron Hunters walked right into our trap, and even gifted allies, in the form of yourselves, to the Sien Zhou. That might sound self-interested, but I hope the feeling is mutual. Now that the future has come true, the Sien Zhou has discovered the Legion's intentions, and with everyone's help, has imposed a crushing defeat on Fantilia. No, my friend, this is good. Noi explorăm galaxia numai ca să distrugem un zeu al distrugerii. Pe eu cred că noi practic fiecare plantă pe care o facem sunt pe niște, pentru fiecare pat. Să sunt niște pathuri. Oarecum fiecare nație intră asta credind într-un path de genul ăsta, cred în zeu respectiv. Gen în... Uh, cum mai spune? În uh, Belabog erau pentru preservation, the name of preservation, credeau un zeu preservation -ului, care era chestia care au luat o formă de copil să vrea să cu noi, uh, dar am luat noi puterea de preservation. În Penaconi, Harmony, mai acolo nu știu să fie, dar cred că distraction o să fie ultima vândă în vedere că noi trebuie să, dis să, să distrugem distrugerea. <laughs> When the Ambrosial Arbor was severed by the Rainbow Arbiter thousands of years ago, the abundance became a taboo. Those within the Alchemy Commission, the original masters of the so-called Way of Immortality, were ruined at a stroke. The Commission became a shadow of its former self. Presumably, from that moment on, the seeds of discord for the disciples of Sanctus Medicus had already been planted. Some of them were willing to work with the enemy, acquiring a Stellaron from the Antimatter Legion to try and revive the Abundance. Hmm. They succeeded all right. But why would Fantilia's objective to be to realize their wishes? Those traitors gained nothing. They betrayed the Sienjo only to become sacrificial offerings in the Lord Ravager's grand scheme. That 
we may. But as logical as things might seem, there are still many details about which we're uncertain. For example, how was the Stellaron brought onto the CN Joe? And who sent it onto Scale Gorge Waterscape? How many disciples of Sanctus Medicus still remain at large? All of this is a mystery. Thus far, we've done our best. I'm submitting my report to the Alliance, and I've already got a plan in mind. All of you will feature in the report. But for the sake of Jin Yuan, anything related to Sien Zhou internal affairs will have names redacted. I hope you can forgive me. I was about to make the same request, Master Diviner. Since the Arbor's resurrection, I'm sure the Alliance will be poring over every detail of the report. I fear that if the Astral Express gets dragged into matters, leaving will not be an easy task. Mm. Jin Yuan has committed quite a few violations this time around, and I'll have to deal with them one by one. <sighs> Cloud Knight Generals are all such a hassle. Before you leave, please make time to recuperate. If there's anywhere you'd like to visit, Feel free to take a look. I must attend to some Cloud Knight matters. Farewell for now. Oh, if you pass through Starskiff Haven, I have something that I hope you can give to Yukon. <sighs> it was all so chaotic. When Fantilia took form, it was as if Ting Yun vanished into thin air. The Cloud Knights were only able to find her fan. She took it with her everywhere. It's currently unclear if Ting Yun was a puppet manipulated by Fantilia, or if some form of deception was used to cloud her vision. I am already prepared for the worst. Considering how the Legion operates, I fear the fate of the Skyfaring Commission Amicassador may be a bleak one. As for how matters are handled with regards to Ting Yun, I believe it's best left to her foxy and Ken. I have informed the Skyfaring Commission of the events which took place. And I think it would be best if you were the one to deliver this item to Yu Kong. I understand. Leave it with us. Thank you, Mr. Yang. Now, let me take a look at my remaining duties for the day. <sighs> it's quite the list. It's getting late. If you need me, I'll be in the Divination Commission Conclave Hall. Damn, I've won 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 the Divination Commission Mergem harta Space Station Să facem quest ăsta, să facem quest-ul cu... Uh, încă un quest care să ne mai apară, sau de fapt două quest să ne mai apară Deci după asta ne apară încă unul care să este fie de la Bog Cu... Nu... Care e mă? La F4, F3 Cu... Topaz După trebuie să ne apară ăla cu Jingliu, quest cu Jingliu, pentru meu. Și abia după, da, o să fac întâi chis ăsta, companion mission-urile astea, că sunt interesante. Și abia după o să trebuiască să aduc penaconi. Să fie <laughs> câteva episoade de quest grinding, ce pot să spun. The moon shines on the truth. Whoops. <laughs> 